All right, so with respect to the pumping station, um, just to give you a little background, the four pumps that are designed for the pumping station, um, they are basically over designed, right? Because the pumping station really only needs two screws to eliminate the water from the canal. But we have two additional screws as backup, right? Because each pump basically um, could pump 1.25 cubic meters per second. And so the two pumps would pump 2.25 cubic meters um, per second, which is equivalent to about 474 gallons per minute. With that, the two pumps are more than sufficient to eliminate the water from uh, Collect Canal and from um, Southside Canal. During the rainfall event that we had over the weekend, uh, carrying through to Monday, the canals were not at its capacity. So the canal still had capacity for runoff to come in from the side drains into the canal. So basically there was no need for us to operate those pumps. The pumps are there and they're designed for when the canals are full, when they're overtopping its bunk as a result of high tide, then we need to put those pumps into operation. But there was no need for us to do that because when you look in the canal, all three canals that are connected to um, the pumping station, you still had over 18 inches of capacity that could accommodate runoff from the side drains. And that was what was occurring. And then we had low tide thereafter. And so you saw the water going out on its own. These pumps are very um, expensive as well to operate. So it, if it's not needed for us to operate those pumps, then there's no need for us to, to put them on.